four years ago, nobody heard about Bohemia in Switzerland. It was unknown destination. Uh, well, Bohemian Switzerland is the youngest of uh, national parks in the Czech Republic. It lies in the north of Bohemia, not really far from Prague. Uh, well, Bohemian Switzerland is famous for rock formations, uh, canyons and sandstone pillars or towers, cliffs, viewpoints, all that. Bohemian Switzerland is the place for hiking in the Czech Republic. It's so beautiful and with so many trails you can take, leading to great viewpoints overlooking canyons. Then you can take paths leading down there to gorges where you can sail on a small boat through a really peaceful river. Well, one of the favorite things on bringing people to Bohemian Switzerland is I can show them that there is way more than Prague to visit in Czech Republic and it's still unknown yet beautiful. And when I'm outdoors in Bohemian Switzerland, I feel like I'm living the life. Yeah, I really feel like alive, it's hard to describe. Or Vitek Slezak, I'm from Děčín, Czech Republic, which is a town in Bohemian Switzerland. It's a nice place, uh, surrounded by nature. It's actually the greenest town in the whole Czech Republic. Before I started Northern Hikes, I was doing the typical corporate story. I was really happy employee at one of the big corporations, earning really nice salary, but do I really want to sit next 30 years in front of a laptop and uh, uh, is that my future? So I actually went on a crazy hike through Slovakia. From west to east, I covered some 600 kilometers, which is roughly 400 miles in a row. So in some 40 days, I kind of realized that I want to do something with nature. I want to breathe fresh air, not sit in the office, be locked down in front of the computer. And I want to enjoy the outdoors and create some memories that will stay with me for my whole life. And then in Bohemian Switzerland, I can invite others to do the same and give them beautiful experience. The Café and Canyons tour is one of our first tries to fight the over-tourism in the national park. And I'm really hoping we will succeed with this. We want to show you some really nice, local, secret, hidden places where I would go in the Bohemian Switzerland. There are some other, more popular places, but thousands of people go there. So we want to offer an alternative route, something really special, and get you extra cup of coffee from local guys who are brewing it not far from Bohemian Switzerland and we will make it for you freshly, directly on the spot. So some of the companies Northern Hikes partner with are local businesses which are owned by local people. For example, there is an awesome uh, brewery Falkenstein, there is Bohemian Coffee House, there is a bar on a meadow called Luchini Bar, and uh, they all share pretty much the same values as we do. It's responsible tourism and cooperation within the region. Well, Luchini Bar is a really special place where people who probably just finished their hikes can meet, sit there, bake a sausage, enjoy a fresh cold beer and talk about their own experiences, uh, about the places they visited in Bohemian Switzerland and pretty much about the joy they had when they spent the time outdoors hiking. Why to choose Bohemian Switzerland? Because it's easy to get there from Prague and because it's different than seeing another historical town like Karlovy Vary, Kutná Hora, Český Kromov, those are old towns. This is a new activity. People are looking for new stuff. Well, Bohemian Switzerland for me means home, actually. It's, it's the most sacred place in Czech Republic for me. It's a whole park to discover different viewpoints, lookout towers, different gorges. So it's all yours and go and discover.